Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Shitcast, the number one Shitcast episode podcast in all of Thailand. I kind of messed up the intro there, but that's okay. So, yeah, I'm your co host, Rev, and today uh, I'm here with my other co host, Moxie. You know, Tha- Thailand's a really good. It is. I'm glad. You, I'm glad that we're getting noticed there, getting our. Because the the folk of Thailand are just really nice. They're really great people. If you're from Thailand, you also have right Luke. Yeah, like from. What is a Thailand? Oh my. <laughs> oh no, <brother! laughs> We have Hap. Um. So basically, Luke, Thailand is basically a land made of tiles. Oh, oh, that's, that's, oh, you can't. Oh, <laughs> restart. Yep, we have Gary. We're not fucking restarting shit. <laughs> and our special <laughs> guest that. today, we have Hammer. Canada's real? What? Surprisingly. And also joining us today for the first time, we that's have Adam that's... the Master Builder. Great Berserk. Wait, hold on, I have a crowd of... Hold on. Alright, the voice Okay, uh, uh, Adam, say your quirky one-liner again. Read Berserk. Damn it, oh. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> no, no voice issues, no nothing. No, 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 that right. No. Bro, why the hell are you on Helium? Who's on Helium? Are you, are you fucking kidding me? Hold on, I'll be right back. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, what's going on? <laughs> What? Apparently his voice is high, but like this is the first time I've heard his voice. And we're back. Uh, sorry about that, guys. Technical issues. But uh, today, for the topic of this podcast, we're going to be doing another "Would You Rather" because you guys really seem to enjoy those, and we like making those because you know you never know what kind of wacky questions we- we're going to stumble upon. You know. All right. Am uh, Am I right, guys? Are you guys here? You yes. Guys- Yes, yeah. right here. Gary. <gasps> All right. Gary. All right. Gary. Right. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, just to make sure, like, everybody gets their saying and, uh, and, and stuff like that, Um, we're going to be doing what we usually do whenever there's, like, a lot of people in there, where if there's a question, we'll just go one by one, how we usually do, just to make sure everybody gets to say their stuff. So, yeah. Uh, this this first are you yawning, Moxie? I know that was you. Hey, I yawned. Is that a problem? <laughs> Come on, man! You got to bring some energy. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the first question. Okay, we're gonna start with Hammer since he's the first person on my screen. Uh, Ham- oh, okay. Hammer, would you rather be in jail for five years or be in a coma for a decade? Be in jail for five years because at least I'll be able to, like, you know, it's not gonna be a good five years, but hey, at least I'm gonna experience those five years. Mm-hmm. There's a- I'm gonna experience the twentieth of month. Mu- that's basically saying, would you rather live a crappy? your life or would you rather just miss a, a decade of it that is I, I guess yeah a lot of people are gonna that's like a, a, like if people live to like 70 80 or whatever it's basically like a seventh or an eighth or a ninth of your life that you're just missing out you know yeah all right what about you adam i do not know why anyone would wouldn't pick um fucking the first one jail for five years like i do not know why anyone wouldn't pick that Honest, okay. It, 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 hap? I've been in hell for five years. <laughs> oh gosh. That doesn't sound pleasant. I'm sorry to hear that, bud. Uh, Anyways, moving on. Uh, Gary? Uh, how long is the coma? Ten. A, 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 decade, a, a decade. Ten years. A decade. Uh, no, I guess the jail, yeah. <laughs> Luke? Jail's kind of scary. I don't know. Maybe a coma. It'd be interesting. That'd be interesting if I... Okay. Oh, thank you. Okay, Moxie. I don't think any... Moxie. Uh, uh, it'd be interesting if I just fell asleep and woke up ten years later. That'd be kind of cool. What? Well, 
Moxie, what you you say you? Oh, coma. You 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 want to be in a coma for ten years? Uh, yeah, because I would just blink and then wake up. That's coma. Hundred percent. Well, well, you I... wouldn't be conscious. So think about it. You would just be. It would. It's sometimes like when you take a hard sleep, you would just blink and then boom, ten years later. But then again. Okay. Here, actually, you wouldn't miss out like an entire like ten years of your life, though. Okay, it wouldn't feel like ten years to me. But what about like your, what about your friends and your family? <laughs> well, I would miss Rewan Rev. You're kind of right there. <laughs> what if one day you wake up and I'm just I have kids and I'm thirty years old, and I... I'd be like, Yo, Rev, in ten years, <laughs> your life sucks. <laughs> You, you, I mean, kids can be nice. Kids can be nice to have, or they can be the worst mm -hmm. mistake of your life. Gary, you're saying you wouldn't have kids at a at near thirty. Near thirty sounds like the good age. No, you said you said you'd be thirty in ten years. Exactly. Well, oh. I said near thirty. He'd be, he'd be in ten years. He'd be twenty nine. So he's right. I, exactly. I just basically estimated it. I I rounded it up. He, he, you round it up. Round it. It's better. It's better saying thirty than just oh yeah, I'm gonna be twenty nine. You don't have to fucking put my age out there, man. So, I'm... so Rob, I'm guessing you would what? pick the you... jail option. What's up? I'm guessing you would pick the jail option. Yeah, man. <clears throat> I mean, I wouldn't enjoy being in jail. I'm pretty sure nobody wants to be in jail, but at least I have I'll have something to do and be conscious instead of just not being able to see my friends or not being able to see my family well actually it's basically the same thing but i'm conscious it's basically the same thing but you have a conscious and it's and it's uh half shorter. the time yeah all right yeah but but jail is dangerous i wouldn't i don't want real one rev to get beat up in a prison here i would hate that it's gonna be fine it, as long he's as not I... going to jail <laughs> as as long as you just Keep your head. That prison sentence would have, that prison sentence would have gone down differently if I was there. What, what do you mean by that? I'm, I'm scared. <laughs> it, it, it's it's a quote someone made once. Sorry. I wouldn't. Okay. Not, yeah. I, I don't just, think. I don't think yeah. I just, I'm just gonna need these. Okay. Yeah. I I guess none of y'all get the reference. <laughs> my scrawny my scrawny teenager arms are not gonna put up any scrap. I'm just gonna sit there and wait, not start anything. Oh, but, but then the police guards are going to be like, God, don't give me 20! But when you do the 20, they're like, That's <laughs> not how it, that's, I don't think that's how that works. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll type the context of the joke and then uh, Mike called up. Okay. Right. Anyway, Rev, next topic. Do, do, do. Okay. What? Uh, would you, n would you rather never be able to go out during the day or never be able to go out at night? Day. 100% never go out at day. Never go out at night. What the heck are you going to do at night? Exactly. What aren't you gonna do at night? Night is like dangerous. Did you not watch the Teen it's dangerous. Did you not watch the Teen Titans Go episode. Not. Night. Night begins to shine when the night. I don't think that's. I don't think that's relevant. I don't think that. I think. I think it is relevant because. It, the, wouldn't you want to shine at night? No, I'm night talking about you have the episodes mixed up. Just because it was nighttime doesn't mean that they sung that song. Oh yeah, I know, but the song is about the nighttime. No, it, no, it it's is really not. not. <laughs> That's all. It's only in the title, Moxie. But why would they call it that? What is this? Fucking god! So I, so I saw the first lyric. Literally, is I saw you dance. That's about the night. Yes. Because yeah. when when <laughs> would you go out dancing so... in the middle of the day? Would you go out dancing in the middle of the day? Yeah, if you're you can dance, you can if you, you could, yeah. If you go to like no, shuffling stuff or like raves oh, or a wedding, <laughs> you could go like you go to, like a wedding. Yeah, um, I will only go to uh, Gary's wedding. Let's go. <laughs> okay, wait. Then again, though. Then again, if you if you weren't allowed to go out today, yeah. you could skip school. Hmm. Mm. I personally just don't want to go out in the night because I like it, it. It's I mean I do like nighttime, but like it, it's night just it's dangerous, man. You don't know what kind of shit. You don't mm. know how, what kind of weird people are out at that time. You're gonna be 
freaking just have a loud. You voice. don't know what kind of red moxies are out at that time. Skinwalkers. <laughs> There's red moxies. There's more. Uh, uh, There's more than one. <laughs> actually, kind of thinking about it, this this question to me would kind of change answers depending on what season it is. Because like summer, you're gonna get till like eight o'clock or nine o'clock, or, or from where from where I am, you're gonna get like a good twelve, thirteen hours of sun. But like say in the winter, you're losing like a bunch of time, like five, six hours. Hmm. I still and pick. I still pick not be able to go out at night. And think about it. If you pick, if you pick day, you're only going outside at the hottest time of the year. True, but then again, that could also relate to snow. Okay, but I'd rather be cold than hot. You're hot and you're cold. cold. <laughs> yes. You're hot and you're cold. Uh, didn't you say you thought that was a Katy Perry song? It is a Katy Perry song. It is? Yeah. Uh, yes, it oh, is. Tried to make me look dumb. <laughs> oh. Yeah. You know that? <laughs> Fuck you. What's up, Adam? Yeah. No, I, I said Katy Perry's a mid artist. Wow. Oh, I, got, I gotta get out of here before Rev goes crazy. Uh, Gary, we gotta leave. No. no. Gotta leave. Okay. I'm just, okay. I'm just, no, I'm just surprised. That's, that's a really, that's a really hot take, man. <laughs> It's holding a really bold hair. statement think, punches the wall. It's a really bold statement. Those, I think all those really, honestly, I think all those really big popular pop singers are mid as fuck. Honestly, like, um, <laughs> could you name them all one by one? Uh, I think Taylor Swift is mid. I think okay. Ed Sheeran's mid. That's, I think all right. All right. All one mid. ticket to Milwaukee, please. I, I agree all on right. Ed Sheeran. I agree on Ed Sheeran. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I don't understand their fan bases, man. How, how, how do you feel, wait, wait, wait. How do you feel about Bruno Mars? Mid. <laughs> what about Lady Gaga? Mid. <laughs> what what type of music do you listen to, Adam? That you have these bold mm. takes. I'm my, fa my favorite. Artists, listen to this. No, my favorite artists are Linkin Park, Gorillaz, and Nirvana. Ooh, so. those are really good. You'd be the type actually. of person. You, you know that one episode of regular show or broadcast? Like, wait, listen. Oh, bah, 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 oh, it's the best part. <laughs> Brain explosion. <laughs> Brain, yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Uh, bang, 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 bang. Those are still pretty, some pretty good artists, Adam. I'm not gonna okay. lie, I'm the type of loser to listen to video games for like hours straight. Because some of those tracks, though. Did you say if you were straight? <laughs> what? <laughs> That's what I heard. I'm sorry. I had to had to make sure I heard that correctly. What, what do you think I said? I don't. Got it. What I just said. <laughs> Ooh, get him. <laughs> Alright, anyways. Let's Next fun. question. Alright. Uh, would you rather... No, no, no. Shut the fuck up. Would you rather... No, we didn't get through everyone. Oh, Luke, what would you choose? Oh, oh no. You what? didn't say oh, anything. Yeah. Uh, uh, go out at daytime, because... I like nighttime and not night owl, but, like, I'm inside. Oh, I don't think... I don't think I was asked either. either. Oh, I'm sorry, Adam. I'm sorry. I thought you answered. Yeah. Uh... You don't... To answer with your would, would, you, would you rather not be able to go out a day or night? I go out a day. Never go out that, during the day. Oh yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd rather never go. Out. I mean, I'd rather, wait, wait, wait. What was the question? Mm -hmm. Repeat would you the question again. I didn't go out a day or only go out at night. Only go out a day or only go out at night. I'm gonna say only go out a day. Okay, yeah. good. So yeah, because you were cutting, you were cutting out for me for a little for a second there. Yeah. If it was for me though, I would. If it was like some, if it was winter, I'd pick only go out at night, because that's a lot more time than going out a day. It's really not, but okay. I mean, it's like five more hours <laughs> out inside. It's re it's still really not, but whatever. It just depends it's what okay, type of like dab on them. <laughs> it just depends what time of night that you go out, man. All right. Would, would you rather wear the same socks for a month or the same underwear for a week? Wait, you uh, right? same socks for a month. Oh, I'd rather just wear the same underwear. Same, same socks for a month because here's a loophole I just found. I don't wear socks. But you have to wear the same socks. I'd rather just pick underwear. <laughs> for a week. For a week. You could still shower, but like... Yeah, you could still shower, but you have to make sure that you're just not 
getting your underwear dirty. Oh gosh, imagine you yeah you, you get uh you get the poopoos. <laughs> you can't make the toilet. Uh oh, poopoo. Why not? Go, why not? Okay. Um, I don't see who would choose the freaking underwear besides Hammer. Uh, I would fucking go with the sock easily. Well, we have to wait until everybody else answers to see who would. Well, no shit, a Rev. I know that. I know that. All right, all right, Bell. We're doing. Would you rather? So, okay. By the way, Bell's here. Um, it's uh the question is, would you rather wear the same socks Maybe for a month? Would you rather wear the same socks for a month or the same underwear for a week? Same socks. Okay, Adam. Oh no, Adam already answered, right? Yeah, I said same socks. All right, Gary. Can I wear stockings? I don't understand. Okay. I don't understand why I had to be specific. It's just any socks, man. But yeah, yeah, socks. You're so you're walking around with fish nets on. <laughs> Everybody's okay. Super Mario socks. Uh, Luke. Oh, um, um, I don't know underwear. I do that already. I've been wearing the same pair of underwear for like a year now. Just kidding. <laughs> you're disgusting. <laughs> It's actually gross. That no, underwear, because socks are so just uncomfortable. Bro, I, actually I, know. I hate wearing socks. I know, like, I, when I'm I trying to sleep, I cannot fall asleep with socks on. I gotta wear the same socks every or month. That'd be Why terrible. would you sleep with socks on? <laughs> Why exactly. would you not? Fuck, that's what I do. <sighs> Who sleeps with socks on? Exactly, what I the What I'm saying. Ooh, I want to ask a question. Okay, what is it? Would you rather never be able to buy another video game, or every video game you buy, you have to 100% it? Never buy another video game. Mm. Uh, 100%. Every game I get. True, but if you if you buy a new video game and it's like Dark Souls or something, oh, goodbye. I can do that easily, Dark Souls is gaming. I nothing mean... <laughs> You said never like, buy a game. Buy another game. I just, I, I can just say I would one hundred percent Dark Souls and never do it. That is. Okay. Don't if you, you said. If you don't do it, then a scary man named Jared from Subway. No, shut the fuck <laughs> up. up. <laughs> All right, my, my... I, there's a loop. I, I found a loophole because he said never buy a video game. You could easily just like emulate them. But got a point. He's actually smart. You have to. You still have to be in possession of a game. Or what? Why or what? Just... What's gonna happen? Yeah, just the Nintendo like the ninjas, ninjas are gonna get on your ass. Not the ninjas. Not the not the Fortnite ninja. Oh my fucking gosh, <laughs> Moxie. Yeah, that's me. Oh, you didn't answer the uh, the question with the the socks and the underwear. Go ahead. Did you, uh -huh. well, did, did you not yep. hear it? I wasn't here. Go ahead. Okay, would you rather wear the same socks for a month or the same underwear for a week? Same socks. All right. I mean, oh, I got them mixed up. The same underwear for a week? I thought it was the same underwear for a month and the same socks for a week. N no, it's the other way around, Hap. Listen, you could... Okay, Why? then I might actually go with the underwear. What? <laughs> Y'all are disgusting. No, 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 no. Listen, listen. Rev said you could shower, and I am not fucking sleeping with fucking socks on. That, that's just socks. You don't have to. You just have to rewear them. Yeah, you don't have to wear them all the time. Oh, yeah. then I'll take the socks. Never mind then. Exactly. <laughs> oh unless, you're, unless you're Luke Man 141 who sleeps with socks on. <laughs> Ew. What? What is wrong with you? Wrong with sleeping with fucking socks on. Okay, we're gonna have to have a talk, Bell. We're gonna have a. We're gonna need to have a talk. <sighs> All right. You can, no. No. Would you rap? <laughs> what are you laughing at, Hap? What if fucking is the one sitting in the chat? Theodore Steele is the main antagonist of the natural world. I'm, okay, we're not gonna we're not gonna read that. We're not gonna read, we're not gonna read that. Just read it in your head. Don't say it on the podcast. What, what? Gary? What are those legs? 
<laughs> oh, cause, Gary. oh, cause Gary asked if he could wear stockings. <laughs> oh, good for you, Gary. I, I, I hope you like them. Or music that they get stretched. I mean, he doesn't have arms, so the legs are. He's gonna have to strut them off, man. I, I respect it. Oh, well. Hap's oh, <laughs> going. Okay. Um, would you rather spend a week in the forest or a night in a real haunted house? Nightwear. The night. I'd uh, spend the night in a real haunted house. Oh, uh, a haunted are, house. Uh, how dangerous are the ghosts? Like, are they like, are they gonna kill me? Type of dangerous, or are they just uh? They they ooga, ooga. they own. Hmm. Okay, for both stipulations, for the forest, you're you don't have like any supplies with you. You're just in the forest house. Automatically house and automatically. But in the house, but it. That's an automatic house choice. <laughs> Can you let me finish? All right. But in the the haunted house, they are trying to kill you. Hmm. But because both option though, right? because both options are dangerous. It's only one night though, right? Yes, yeah, only one night. Then I would take the haunt. Can I have the dragon slayer from berserk with me? Because, just think about can it, I ghost. Can I have a holy cross with me in the haunted house and banish the ghost? You don't have any supplies with you for both options. You just have to make do with your surroundings. Well, think okay, about it. Okay, so basically, this is asking, would you rather fight astral beings for one night or would you rather fight, like, a bear for a week? But you never know what, what like, other forest animals or anything is going to come at you. You could just be chilling in the forest right. by yourself. I would pick. I, I would pick haunted. I'm picking haunted house because at least I'll have shelter. Yeah, like what if it rains? I don't want to be wet. Hey. Thank you. All right, Adam. A Adam, you here? Gary. At the haunted house. Luke. Um, I don't know, maybe the forest. It'd be like a camping trip. Just Thank you. You don't have any supplies. You don't have any supplies. You don't get a tent. You, well, I'd, I'd make a tent. You would, my, have you, you were the type of person to I'd eat pick up giant you know logs with my huge muscles and craft a house. Have you never seen, you know you would. Have you never seen the, the Mr. Beast video with them in the rainforest? Yeah. yeah. He, he would be the guy who got poisoned. I forgot their name. <sighs> You're stupid. I haven't seen it in a while, Rev. I'm sorry. That's Mandler. Okay, that's Mandler. <laughs> Chandler, that's his name. Gary <laughs> said Mandler. I'm like, Gary. I don't know. I don't really know how to like stop ghosts or anything, but like a bear. Adam like, Mandler. Yeah, you could stab <laughs> it with a stick or something, yeah. You could, <laughs> you could stab it with a stick. Brother, it better be a fucking sharp ass stick to take down night. a fucking bear. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Think about it though. Grizzlies? Those grizzlies are gonna tear you limb from limb. No, dude, they're gonna invite me back to their cave with their their brothers. One's a panda bear, one's a the polar bear. <gasps> dude, I'll make a tree house, and then nothing can get me up there. Uh, mosquitoes. Okay. No, honestly, <laughs> I, I'm with you, Luke. I would honestly spend a week in the forest just to like up the ante and you know upgrade my survival my survival skills because that sounds pretty fun. Yeah, you know what? Let's just go on a big camping trip, just us two, and leave everyone else in a haunted house to die to ghosts. I think that's we, good. Yeah, the ghosts are trying to kill you. You don't know how powerful these ghosts are, man. Listen, you put, you put, no, no, you put me and Gary in a situation together, we are gonna find a way to get out of it. Okay, but here's We're gonna be like fucking Scooby doing like run through yep. like multiple doors yep. while like us chase us. Okay, here's yep. the thing though. If we're talking about FNAF 3 rules, the phantoms cannot kill Meaning. Oh. Phantoms. It's an interesting way to put it. it. So, <laughs> it going by that logic, I would rather pick the haunted house. Oh. All right, we'll split up. Moxie, Gary, you go separate. Okay. You don't. Do not say that. You never split up. Any See, Hammer would be the first to die. Yeah, I'm because splitting. Be strong, but they ain't bulletproof. <laughs> that is true. Just Hammer, hammer immediately splits up. Immediately. First take. <laughs> First second, I'm like, okay, let's split up. 
Shaggy. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. And then me and Gary like. Okay. Man, what an idiot. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go get a sandwich. <laughs> yeah, let's go make a sandwich. <laughs> and then it's the it's like the it's that it's me and Gary's favorite gift that we love of Shaggy Look, it's me. on the motorcycle. <laughs> no, not that one. I'm talking about Shaggy on the motorcycle. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love the gift of Shaggy. He drives into the motorcycle. It's so smooth. <laughs> Such a good gift. <laughs> All right. Would you rather die in twenty years with no regrets, or live to a hundred with a lot of regrets? Uh, what you get the fuck off? What do you say? Okay, Hammer. You. Go oh, Hammer. Um. Would, ha uh, ha Hammer, would you die in 20 years with no regrets or live to 100 with a lot of regrets? 20. Why? It's not live till 20. It's like 20. Yeah, 20 years from now, you're going to die. But you'll have no I regrets. Mean, I mean, basically, 35 with no regrets is, I'd say, a solid life. Not amazing, but like. I mean, I wouldn't have to regret anything, I guess. Didn't even make it halfway. But it's the it's just the choices that you make to to make to have no regrets. I I don't know actually. It's kind of tough. Gary, it's, what about you? Gary literally just DM me right now. He said he's gonna be right back, so we're just gonna skip him. God. Wow. Oh. All right, Adam. Damn. Oh. Um, one hundred with lots of regrets. <laughs> How come? Because regrets are what teach me. That is. That yeah, is. That is oh, true. Fair point. Fair point. Fair point. I pick. I pick hundred. I pick hundred. You can't but change. Then... You cannot change. You pick. Hey, hey, hey! You don't get to decide the rules. And just for you acting silly, <laughs> this is going on the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> Bell. What? Oh, oh, fucking. Uh, uh, one hundred with regrets. All right, all right. I don't give a shit. <laughs> be better than Netflix. Well, you have to give a shit in order to feel regretful. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Maybe, maybe be regretful for that PFP. You should probably change the PFP. Change your fucking PFP, Bell. I don't. Oh. I don't like that. Okay, we're just gonna. Oh, good. <laughs> all right, Luke. Shut up, Hammer. Well, no. Well, Sorry. I mean. If he died at 35 with no regrets, it'd be, like, sad to know that, like, wow, my life is going so good, now I'm gonna die. But yeah, if I lived to 100 with a lot of regrets, I'd kind of be accepting it. Like, wow, you know, life kind of took a turn. You don't know when you're gonna die. Like, was, if I died right now, at least I'd be at peace, you know? Like, you don't know you're gonna die. The, uh, Moxie, it specifically says, in 20 years from now, you're going to die. But it, you're going to live, but in the other option, you but are going to live to 100. Okay, this is a hypothetical, though. It's saying 20 years from your current point. That means you wouldn't know that you're going to die, but you would die without regrets. What? Oh, I thought it was 35. It's 20 years from no, now. No, oh, he, okay. if Hammer was just saying 35 because of his age right now, he just said... No, because I'm, I'm... Oh. Yeah. I'm a young boy, but my voice is, sounds like I'm... Like, no, the fuck it doesn't. <laughs> Moxie, but it's Do just saying... It's just, what do I need? It, it just says 20 years with no regrets. It says die in 20 years. It doesn't say you're, you're going to live for 20 years. No, no, no. I know that. That's what I meant. Yeah. You're still not going to know when you're going to die, though. D yes, it is. Yes, you do. You this is a hypothetical question asking you. But it says you're going to die in th 20 years with no yes, regrets. Yes, but that's asking us. The hypothetical, though, is we would be living our life, and then we would just die in 20 years from our current point right now. We wouldn't it's, know about it. This is kind of... <laughs> Either way, I would pick the 100 years option. Because I'm not dying early. Fuck that. Yeah. I would honestly pick 100 as well, because not that many people will get to live to 100. A lot, Lots of people usually die whenever they're... Well, I, I was, like, for college right now, I'm taking, like, lifespan development for psychology classes and stuff like that. And it said in the United States that the like the average like death or like the average age of death is like seventy eight, which is actually oh, gosh. which is actually not really that bad because 
it, it, it's close to 80, which is close to 100, which, you know, like I said, not that many people, not that many people get to live to 100, but just being 78 and just, you know, living that long, it does, it, it does, yeah, I don't, I don't really know how to transition from that, but I'm just saying not that many people do get to live to 100 years. So being able to live to that age seems awesome. Yeah. I would want to live as much life as I can, you know. True. I'd like to. I'd like to live my life as a. As a... Sure, I'm gonna have a lot of regrets, but like, but like what Adam said, I'm gonna learn from that, you know. Yeah, and that can strengthen my bond with you know my my believe my uh, Lord and Savior. That is so not. Sorry. That is I'm not. So sorry. That is I not. Didn't hit it. I didn't even hit it. That, I didn't even hit it. Well, then so how did it activate? How did it activate I, on its own? I don't know. It just happened. I actually didn't hit it. I didn't hit it. I'm genuinely serious. I didn't hit it. You are funny me right now. I'm so sorry. I'm genuinely sorry. Are you? I'm so sorry. I didn't hit it. I'm being honest. I'm being dead honest. I didn't hit it. Okay. All right, going. Okay, just keep it on track. Just keep it on the, I guess the, the this side of I guess life and the the question. Uh, this question is. Uh, okay, Hammer's gonna start first. Uh, the question is: Would you rather die before, or like, say you're like, H Hammer, like you're in this hypothetical, you you're in a relationship, even with the people who are in a relationship in this call. Would you, uh, Hammer, would you rather die before or after your partner? Um. Alright. <laughs> that's tough. Really, that's, that's a really tough one. Um. I don't know, actually. If I had to pick, I guess I would die before my partner. Hmm. Okay. Down. Adam? What was the question again? Would you rather die before or after your partner? If you're in a hypothetical relationship. Probably after, honestly. Uh, okay. Okay. I'd pick before because... No, actually, no, 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 no. Can I slot to after? Because if I pick after, then, like... Oh, I don't... No, oh, I don't know. I don't... Can you come back to me? I'll, I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. Just think it. about it. It's a tough question. Uh, Bell. Before, I would like. Uh, no, hold on. Let me think about it. Yeah, before. Okay. Why? We forgot. Fucking god, I'm mixing myself up. Up uh, after. Okay. Luke? Uh, cause I would rather fucking suffer a death than than them suffering my death. Oh, okay. no, 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 that's, that's what I was trying to say. Thank you, Bell. I'd pick, because I, I would rather suffer the loss than let them suffer it. <coughs> yeah, holy shit. Man, that is, oh, wow, okay. Uh, Luke, you have an answer, or, are you here, Luke? I don't think you're here right now. Moxie? I would die after. What'd you say? You cut out. Oh, I would choose after. Hmm. Uh, because I would want to make sure they're at peace. I would want to make sure that their final moments are okay. Probably that they they're in their life, and that yeah. they know that they're loved and happy, and just that everything goes well with like a funeral procession or whatever they want. Mm -hmm. Just to make sure that they. Yeah, it's um. It's a, it's a, it's a bit tough. Like for for me like if I was in a relationship and if, if the hypothetical if I was just to pick before I know the other I know my partner is going to be hurting more and it'll put more stress on me for my death knowing that I'm going to go before them and they're going to have to live the rest of their life without me. And it 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 just seems like a harder thing especially since like in this hypothetical you're in a relationship you don't know how long you've been in that relationship probably like years decades so knowing that it's it's kind of hard to just pick one definitive answer 
But for this question, I honestly, I would probably have to pick after as well, knowing that, like, even if now, like, even if it's just like, if I get into a relationship now, and I'm with them for like a couple of years, and they get diagnosed with like a, 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 a life-threatening disease or something like that, I will be able to like live the rest of my life knowing them and t- t- I guess telling their story in a sense, knowing that I yeah, that's why I chose it. Yeah, because like I need someone to keep their memory alive. Yeah, it just I just I just chose after because I didn't want anybody to suffer. You know, I get that. It... But okay. uh, the, the the sense that I'm saying, but the sense that I'm saying right now is like I I knew that person. I know who they were. And I know their story can change other people. And I, I, knowing them, I changed because of them. And I'm a different person because of them. So, yeah, I'd, yeah, I'd probably say after. So, yeah. I wish I was better with these kind of dark topics. Because I, I, I like the um, idea of keeping on with a few dark topics. But, like, I can't really think of anything. It's not really. Uh, I wouldn't really classify it as, like, like, a dark topic. I would probably say, like... I guess reality in a sense because in reality you know we're all going to go through that but we just don't know when we're all still pretty young can i send you a meme yeah let's just try to line up the mood i guess after all those topics maybe the viewers might not want to be too afraid i guess i don't know it's it's a christian meme which is why i'm sending it to you because i always send christian rev that is true (laughs) rev can you send me those I want I want more Christian memes in my life. I don't I don't ever I don't, ever, like I don't ever remember you oh sending God, why is that in our DMs? What is that, that Rev? <laughs> You're the one who sent that if if it's what I I'm did, thinking. It's my fault. It is my fault. You're right, but right. oh god. Some th- a topic I am actually good at is video games and I would have liked to ask about video games. How game do you feel about that image, Rev? I mean, it's facts, man. It is. All right, it just ha- is. All right, Hammer. You you had the video game. Yeah. Okay. So there are a bunch of video game types, types. But okay. Uh, freaking. Would you rather? Oh frick! I had the. Oh fudge! I had the question in my mind. Uh. Actually, no. We come back. <laughs> all right to line up the mood i'll i'll just say this one. Oh, what a, hold up what a bell send me all right okay i read the first thing i'm not gonna i'm not looking on i'm not looking at that anymore <laughs> all right what did she say don't worry about it would you rather walk in on your parents or have them walk Wait. in on <laughs> Hey yo! Uh, Would you rather walk rather in? Walk no, in on... no, you didn't let me finish. Would you rather walk in on your parents or have them walk in on you? Okay, okay, let's. No, okay, no, no. I'd rather okay. Have, I'd rather just walk in on my parents because I'd be like, mommy. What? Dad, what? Yeah, mommy? I'd rather. I'd rather. Yeah, I'd dad. rather just walk Look, in on me. Okay, okay. 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 Um. I'd probably want to walk in on my parents so I could just be like, Hi! <laughs> what? That, why would you do that? Only fans. What? 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 <laughs> you gotta make Blackmail! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm a family guy. <laughs> I would rather have them walking in. What? Why? I'd rather have. Honestly, I would I rather w- want them no, walking in on me. I don't want to walk in on them. Yeah, and, but then, then, and then yeah, but then they're gonna be all like, "Oh, we're gonna make fun of what? you for this." One. No, they're not. If they're your parents, and if, oh, and if they respect God. you, like you respect them, they're just gonna be like, "Oh, okay," okay and they're just gonna close the door. Yeah, but what if they go like? I don't have one. <laughs> don't don't. I I don't want you making a joke about this one, Hammer. <laughs> Drop it. Let's Aww. move on. <laughs> what if I have no parents? Not funny. I, I, I would say, like, yeah. Wh- why not? Yeah, go on. <laughs> my mom would probably be like, oh, okay, and then just close the door. But my, oh, my God! But my, That's how I would be like. <laughs> okay. My dad would probably just cheer me on, honestly. What? Yeah. He'd be like, yeah! <laughs> 
Okay, then. I want my dad to go like, yeah, get it, get it, I, son! I, <laughs> I Oh, wow, the sound. Stop playing that, Moxie! <laughs> yeah, I know you're playing it! Okay, the, the time when it was with Hammer, I actually didn't hit it, though. I genuinely did not hit it. Hey, guys. Yes? Fuck all of you. Hi, guys. What? what? Wow. Hi. Alright. Would you rather have a uh, have a third nipple or an extra toe? I want extra a third toe. nipple. <laughs> what are you gonna do with that third nipple, Hammer? Yeah, yeah, like, one? what? Here with the glass. <laughs> he was so happy too. I want like, a third nipple. Like, why do you not want an extra yeah. toe? What is what is it about your toe that you don't want besides just having an extra? Okay, okay. is it? Is it one extra toe or an extra toe on both feet? It's just an extra toe. That's what it just says, singular, not plural. So just okay. So on one of your foot, like on one of your feet, you have an extra toe. I need a uh, middle. I I hope they're in order and not just like there's one like sticking right out of the palm of your foot. Exactly. That's why I would go with a nipple because at least you can hide it. But in the if you have an extra toe, well, imagine can... imagine the things you can accomplish with that. You can never wear flip flops. I just, though. I just remember from that one fucking huh? Family Guy video. <laughs> one nipple. Like, what uh, nipple? Uh, <laughs> two <laughs> nipples. <laughs> oh, uh, three oh, nipples. Oh, no. <laughs> three nipple. Oh my, that's not a nipple. Oh no. But yeah, man, if you have an extra toe, I'm pretty sure you can run faster. You can swim faster. Just yeah, but a third nipple. But the thing is, wait, 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 it's wait, your feet. Wait, 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 what wait, wait, what wait, activities wait. are you doing that expose your feet so much that you don't want? Compared to... I don't even wear flip-flops in the first place. I go in, okay, I go in my pool a lot, okay? I like swimming. Okay, well, who's going to be looking at your feet? Exactly. But if you, but listen, if you listen, if, if you swim if without you, a shirt, they're gonna you, notice the extra you, nipple. Everyone's gonna be looking at that there. little nipple on your okay, chest. Rav. What? Can I pick both? No! <laughs> you have to pick one! Oh, then, third nipple. See, exactly! Alright. I, I gotta- I gotta get out of here. Is it, Luke. Okay. <laughs> he got out of here. He got the F out of here. <laughs> He's carrying an F. <laughs> Adam, is there anything you want to add to this? I don't even- I, I haven't even been listening, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I, I wouldn't either, I wouldn't either just him. listening to all the nipples and the toes. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you guys. I haven't even been listening for like the past two minutes or so. <laughs> That's fair. After Hammer just screamed third nipple, I got a bit scared. <laughs> I want a third nipple! I don't know, third nipple sounds cool. What? Alright. <laughs> Stop playing that. I was typing. I was actually typing. Would you rather... You would you rather have to wear every shirt inside out or every pair of pants backwards? Oh, uh, shirt inside out. Shirt inside out, definitely. Yeah, shirt inside out. Yeah, I'll say the I shirt already do well. the shirt inside out all, all the time because I'm goofy like that, so like... So that was the quickest we've ever gotten through a would you rather. Well, New record. Well, it's just, it was just... Who would want to like... just You see somebody walking down the street and you see like... It looks like you're walking backwards. Yeah, but that also means that like your zipper, if you're wearing like jeans or something with that... It's on the yeah. back. Yeah. Oh, and then <laughs> that scared Bell. <laughs> you say shirt. And if you have to, like, fuck, you have to take a piss. You're gonna have to reach behind your back and just That's unbutton. <laughs> Zip. What? Yeah, it's gonna be hard to figure oh. that out. Yeah. Just that process of just reaching behind you and just unzipping it. Next question. All right. Okay. Good idea. Uh, how long have we been recording? Uh, hold on, let me see. How long have we been recording? 50 minutes. Wow, it has not felt like 50 minutes, honestly. I'm scared. Okay, would you rather be in a zombie apocalypse or a robot apocalypse? Can I get rid zombie. of in the zombie apocalypse? Zombie. Easily. This is an easy one, zombies. Can I get real and rev in the zombie apocalypse? I mean, you can get anybody in the zombie apocalypse just about who you trust. Okay, I would trust you. Alright, Adam? Zombie I'm apocalypse. Say, I don't, I'm, I'm not Adam. Shut up, Bill. What, Adam? Here's Shut up! 
Yeah. I'm a, shut the fuck up. Anyway, I'm going to say zombie. Okay. Wow. Okay. Bill? Uh, zombie apocalypse. I would probably get my ass whooped by a fucking robot. Bro, robots are going to go Mitchells and the machines on my butt. Exactly. Not survive. That. Future. Zombies are an idiot. Up on him and make it like the Jedi video. I don't think it, a robot apocalypse is gonna work, bro. Literally, all you need to do is get your is get your vegetables, and you've won the zombie apocalypse. Do you not know? Oh, it's Plants vs Zombies. I get it. I was about to say, I hate you for making that joke. It's listen, <laughs> listen. Me and Rev know how The Walking Dead works. We would win. Yeah, I I'm in love with The Walking Dead. And I am in love with the Telltale game, so I know the mechanics. I've got a bunch of friends who are big fans of the show, so... Hell yeah, man. Also, you're basically either fighting stupid zombies or robots with high tech. Exactly. Pick the zombies. Zombies are going to be brain low. I'm interested in the show. I mean, no, I mean I'm not going to lie. Negan is peak character design, so... Fuck yes! Yeah. Also, you, you know, gotta be fucking goofy as fuck if you, if you fucking die to a zombie. True. I lose God, either please. way, though, if that's me. This thing oh, is yeah, Hammer, you were probably get your ass whooped by a fucking zombie. Exactly. I can't... Look, if I can barely... Fucking if I can break blood, I'm not beating a zombie. The thing is, like, I would only choose the, the, the zombie apocalypse in the stipulations that I know, with, 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 aka, like, The Walking Dead and stuff. If it was fucking the World War Z zombies, or Zombieland zombies, and oh, fuck that. Yeah, we're screwed. Bro, if, just... it, if it was zombie land, oh, we're all dead. None of us win. I mean, they survive somehow, but I'm talking about World War Z, where they're just fucking, like, piling up and just going 200 miles an hour at you. That's, that's... fucking scary. Bro, just on them. But if we're talking about, like, those childish zombies from Cooties, oh, then no, we all live. They're like... I've never seen that movie, because that movie is dog shit. Exactly. Jeez. Just, what movie? How do you know it's not shit in real world? Cooties. What the fuck get, is that? Basically, it's where the zombie apocalypse spreads through children's chicken nuggets. Yes. What? Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's basically these kids and like they they ate chicken nuggets for lunch and they had like this weird green ass goo that turned them into zombies and now they have, the people like the staff like the teachers and stuff at the school have to fight off the kid zombies. It's fucking terrible. And it was written by like every Saturday Night Live comedian. And the main guy, oh, like the okay, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, <laughs> the everything. The main protagonist is fucking <laughs> Dwight from The Office. Oh God! <laughs> Wait, Rain Wilson? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> anyway, guys, real quick, just let's pause everything real quick. I got a can of Dr Pepper right here. We're gonna see if it makes a good set. Let's hope for a good one, right, Rev? I didn't no. hear shit last time, so... Yeah, I know. Last time was pretty disappointing. I'm hoping this will be right up to my mic. Here we go. Oh! oh. oh. That's, oh. Hot. That's hot. That's hot. That's hot. That was not worthy. What? That was pretty busted. I need to figure out. Next question, Rev. Okay, would you rather eat only pizza for a year or not eat pizza for the next five years? Oh, uh, I'm okay with eating pizza. Because, like, freaking. Like, because if it's only pizza, at some point I'm going to get fat because that's, so, that's greasy. Just and not uh, to mention. Just work just, out. Only a, yeah. There's only a limited amount of things I can actually put on a pizza without it being a horrible. You can like, just have, di you can just have pineapple. different toppings every day. Yeah, you could, like, like one day have cheese, one day have pepperoni. And you don't have to, like, you could probably make it to where you eat your cal your needed calorie total just from the pizza every day and don't eat anything. I had a friend that ate pizza without the cheese. So just the dough and the sauce? That is not, that, that is not your friend. That is, that is a psych. No, it, it's not that bad. I I've eat, I've eaten it sometimes because my my nephews and niece yeah, are lactose good. intolerant, so they have to order it without any cheese, and it's tastes fine, I guess. Wait, you need to tell your stop. 
They're, no, they're lactose intolerant. You want me to eat cheese? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Bro. Uh, no. <laughs> listen, I'm in. Listen, cheese is like one of my favorite. I put cheese in everything. I put cheese in like I put cheese with macaroni. You're supposed oh to. My... You're... You're supposed to. It's the reason oh why it's called God. macaroni and cheese. That's... That was worse than Luke asking if New York was a state. That was genuinely worse. <laughs> oh my I mean, God. I mean, depending on depending on what he means by New York, and I mean that's certainly not true. <laughs> <laughs> he asked blatantly, is New York a state? <laughs> like, you mean uh, actual New York, not New York no, City. I, just. <laughs> I put cheese in uh, sandwiches. <laughs> Shut up and let Adam answer the question. Oh, uh, wait, what was the. I don't know. <laughs> oh my I'm, God. I'm going to say, say naughty pizza for five years. Okay, that's, that's good. But, and then again, like, you're. No. Oh. I don't know what I would choose honestly because like there they have there have been lots of days where I've eaten nothing but pizza for like days because there's nothing else to eat. Bro, I, I only eat pizza when I have friends over, so not that often. Well, for me, like pizza is like one of my favorite foods, so they're just like getting it from like all these different places and just getting it on certain days. And, look, yeah, That's you could get it from different restaurants. You could get store bought. You could make your own. Well, you that, can have variety. That is true, but then again, just like. Your own pizza from scratch. If you don't eat pizza for like five years, you're gonna have to find like another go to go. Yeah, go, there's go no little Caesars. No Bro, little Caesars. Literally, literally, my go to times is salad. Okay, I'm gonna survive perfectly fine. Or you just eat like like another like popular food like burgers or or steaks Fried chicken. or chicken. Yeah. Speaking I got burgers on my mind. My old I want some cheeseburgers. Right. <laughs> just, just for me. I'm in a drive through at Burger King. <laughs> and I need another. I'm going to walk with another name to make a meal so I can get a drink. No, I'm not finished. That's not yeah. everything. Can I please get a double walk? But we're not. <laughs> All right. Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay, I have, I have a question. Would you rather only eat fast food for a month or only eat Chinese food for a month? Fast food. That's Fast food, yeah, and besides Panda yeah. Express, we can cheat the system. I hate Chinese food. Panda Express, cheat the system. Boom. Fast food. Yeah, fast food. That was easy. I don't know what your obsession is with Chinese food, Hammer, but like... It's good food! You have to move up to Chinese? But what? <laughs> whoa, 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 you jumped the gun there, buddy. <laughs> you don't want me to pull on my list, man. Just... Yeah. <laughs> what? I'm sorry, I don't want to eat vlogs. Wow! Wow! <laughs> so look, I'm not saying Chinese. I'm not saying Chinese food is bad, but however, <laughs> I just I I just haven't eaten it enough of my life to like fully just be like you know what I want Chinese. Chinese is good. Like I, I'm not at that point in my life where I'm just like I want Chinese. The only Chinese food I'll get is like sweet and sour chicken. That's like the only thing. I'll yeah, eat. and the thing is, every okay, most Chinese foods are sweet. Yes. I couldn't handle that. I could not handle that. I could not eat sweet for a month. I need. I would go for fast food because at least there you could get like a milkshake. You could get like, uh, you don't. You uh, hold on. Bring that back. No. Excuse okay. Me? Wait. Wait. I, no. Wait. I don't go like. Some, I I like some milkshake flavors. Not all flavors though. What milkshakes do you drink? <laughs> Okay, from, I like milkshakes. From where? <sighs> Hammer, tell me yeah. where you get your milkshakes from now. I get cream. it. Yeah, get them from the ice cream store. Uh, they Hammer. tell it there. We're talking about fast food. Where do you get your fast food milkshakes from? No, I don't get fast food milkshakes. I just mean milkshakes in general. Where do you? <laughs> Where do you get your? That's the question we're asking. From like a, yeah. Oh, I don't know. You get who your... just goes into a like? Who goes into a gas station and just comes out with a milkshake? No. I do. What? The, what? That's a that's a Slurpee. That's not that's not a milkshake. Yeah, you cannot use the double cup Slurpee. Nobody. <laughs> you cannot use the double <laughs> cup cup. <laughs> Literally, nineteen eighty four. Oh my gosh, you cannot fill the double cup slurpee cup. 
All right. But Next literally 1984. Run. Like, that is literally just like George Orwell's book, 1984. <laughs> okay. Oh, my goodness. You cannot drink the Next double question. Uh, Would you no. rather lick Teddy Pat? What? what? I didn't even hear what you said, but I don't want to hear it. <laughs> Stop! No, I know. Never mind. I heard what you said. It's a reference to an. <laughs> it's a reference to a, okay, an episode okay. we did in the past. I'm no. Shut the fuck up. Okay. No, we're not doing this again. We're not Blizzard, doing this. Again. Stop! Stop! <laughs> okay, we're just gonna. We're just I I I just wanna I just wanna preface that like on the topic of milkshakes, there there is a new shake that 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 came out. For a uh, Whataburger, it's called the, the banana pudding milkshake, and it's fucking oh, delicious. Oh, I you oh Rev, I've been meaning to tell you. Banana pudding milkshakes are good as hell. Rev, I've been meaning to tell you. We're getting a Whataburger in our town. That's amazing. That's good. Yes, it, it should is. have. I, don't know. I, I, I think I have a water. I think I have a Whataburger like right outside my house, my neighborhood, actually. I really want to try it, Rev, because you said it was pretty good. Dude, it's amazing. Dude, like. I live in a, <laughs> dude. the The city that I li uh, that I live in, they they literally invented Whataburger. Like the first Whataburger is literally in my city. So like, if you go around my city, there's like a Whataburger on like every street. I'm not even joking. There's there's at least twelve the here. Because of the Weeb Center, there's three places that I want to eat at. I want to eat at Canes. That's good. I want to eat at I want to eat at Whataburger. And I really, just because of Rev's video where he was so happy about that iced tea, I want to eat at Bill Miller's. <laughs> dude, Bill Miller's is fucking amazing, dude. In my house, my mom knows how to cook really good. Your mom can cook? No. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes I cook my own food. I'm not a good cook, though. I, literally, the only food I ever cook is, like, ramen noodles. Oh, man. I want to All right. I got to see something. <laughs> We we're gonna send me some. Okay. Adam, what do you what do you think about Whataburger, Adam? Never been. Oh, oh my! You should, <laughs> you should, buddy. It's a it's, it's a good place. It's very magical. I'm day. I'm just saying this for for Adam and Moxie. If you're if you want to go there, if you want like the best item on the menu, I don't I don't care if like your parents say it's too expensive. You just have to get it. I'm sorry, but the. You have to order the patty melt. That's like the signature burger there. The patty melt I, I is a, is delicious. What comes on it? I have a question because you know how I am with foods. As a secret sauce, it has secret sauce. It has <laughs> onions. It has oh. oh, you don't like onions? Rev, we've been over this. But no, 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 no. It's the it's grilled onions. I just remembered it's grilled onions. So grilled. No, no Rev, we've still been over this either way. Okay, but it has. You could just ask for no onions, man. Yeah, I probably will. Has, I know, I know. Sorry. But it has. It's all on Texas toast. If you guys know what Texas toast is, it's just basically. Oh yeah, Texas I, toast is awesome. It, I like toast. The buns are Texas toast. It's two patties with uh, Monterey Jack cheese. I think that's a cheese. I. I but it's like Monterey white. Monterey Jack is what it's called. Not Monterey Jack is what it's called. Oh yeah, it's it's that cheese with with the secret sauce that they put on there and then the onions I, I i honestly i can't even remember the the other ingredients but like i think that's it i have to look but like it's so delicious it's like so much flavor in your mouth pause it's gonna open up this month Ugh. what wow. is all your favorite what did you just say to me what's your favorite food ever yeah fast food or just are you talking like no, but just, like, no, food in, no, just food in general. Uh, uh, probably like, uh, chicken. That's tough because I actually have like a real, I actually, I actually have a really specific favorite food, but like, I don't know which one it is. Per, um, in, I like, think my favorite food might be salad. Okay, guys, yeah, uh, yeah, be... okay. Adam, this is what the, the Adam and Moxie, this is what How a patty melt looks like. The patty. Ooh. Nice. That looks scrum diddly umptious. Uh, Rev, whenever we Rev, if we ever meet up, are we meeting up in your state or my state? Damn, that looked good. Mm, yeah, that's pretty good. You should taste it. You should get in it. Rev, answer <laughs> me. Caring, 
Rev, if we ever meet up, are we, are we meeting up in or my state? Honestly, your state seems farther. I might, like, if I ever get my driver's license, oh, I am going to get it. But, like, once I do... Well, yeah. Well, it's the same length. You... <laughs> the same length for both of us. And besides, I'm, I'm getting my license in December, so... Well, then you could just drive over here once you leave your yeah, house. If I get if I get permission from Le Mother, or I just run away. All right. Am I allowed to do that when I'm a, when I get a driver's license? Can I just leave? No, y you that... have to wait until you're an actual adult in order to make decisions like that. Because once you're an adult, your parents have well, they still have jurisdiction over you, but at the same time, you it, you are legally bound by the government to do whatever you want. At 18 or 16? 18. That's, that's the okay, legal so, age. Alright, so 18 coming well, not Well, not whatever you want, because that'll literally be bad. You know, there's laws for a reason, but, you know. I'm going to Got drive it. safely in a roundabout, and by that I mean I'm going to just not drive safely at all. Got it, Rev. Whenever mm. I'm 18, we're, we're going to open up the Weeb Center con contact house. I see. Will I be allowed to safely driving the roundabout there and by safely i mean very we'll dangerous. let you come <laughs> over but it's only going to be the main 10 in the in the group chat they're allowed there you're gonna have to get a bigger door for for Hydra. Yeah. <laughs> i will literally drive i will drive dangerously in the roundabout just to get there faster it, it, it would be it would be a c come on wouldn't it be cool living with app oh uh rev oh ruben maybe uh we wouldn't be able to get stoop we would have to wait Sora, we wouldn't be able to get, sadly. You know what? We would get an another question, so shut up. <laughs> so, w Sorry. would would you rather be able to run 100 miles per hour or fly 20 miles per hour? Fly? Because that run. means I'd, like, go to a different country. Run. Yeah? Yeah? Uh, Actually, hold on, hold on. Let me see something. Let me see something real quick. Uh, at what speed can you run water? Can you run... Are you trying to be Jesus? <laughs> no, not walking. I said running. Well, it's the same thing. You're stepping over water. Uh, stepping dying. on, not over. <laughs> Silly goober. Uh, Dude. You have to run three times as fast as you say. 70 miles per hour. So if you go 100 miles per hour, you are able to run on water. So you're so telling me right now that a car has to go 70 miles per hour in order to get over the water. Well, it, it, it would have to, like... Cars are heavy, man. Yeah, like that that's like a f completely fucking different situation, dog. Yeah. <laughs> and like they're made out of metal. Humans, they're also made out of water. Humans float. Most of the What about a rock? Can a rock move besides Dwayne? Can, can, can we ban him? No, 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 no. no. Mike's Are the pioneers? Mike's, you ever see that one episode of um SpongeBob where the rock wins the race? Okay, yeah, and let me ask you something. Is the rock above water? No. Exactly. <laughs> what the f how do you come up with no. this shit, Hammer? How do you just... <laughs> I don't even My know how to describe it. The rock Listen. is literally <laughs> in water. How do you... Listen. My mind is the most random thing in this planet right now. Uh, one minute I could be thinking about the most sad thing ever. Next minute you can hear me talking about how a rock could win a race. Lunar Makanishis in my mind is an enigma. <laughs> you cut off there at the wrong moment. Oh no. Oh <laughs> you cut no. Off there at the wrong moment. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm not gonna I'm gonna keep that part in. Fuck it. Okay. <laughs> but I said I said I said enigma. Good. Like the word. Okay. I just get just again, get right? let's no, you didn't just let's move past, let's move on. E false magma here. <laughs> Would you rather detect every lie you hear or get away with every lie you tell? Get away with every lie. Uh, detect I'm, every lie. I don't care if someone's lying to me. I do care if I can get away with a lie though. I would probably say detect every lie only because I try not to lie as much. Like I, I'm usually a very honest person with my like my family and my friends and stuff. So. Whenever it comes to lying, I'm just like, I, I, I can lie, I just don't want to, you know? Like, listen, I'm not saying I'm a bad person and I lie a lot, but get, lying and getting away with it 
and never be do you ever get found out no it says you get away with you're so making it, it seem get... worse than than what it's putting on listen buddy if you could get get away with a single white lie like let's say hammer has some really cool shoes that he like but they have holes in them they're ugly i would tell him hey man you should wear those shoes everywhere you go he would no he wouldn't <laughs> no actually, actually actually no i would i would exactly I got the photo <laughs> No, can I be frankly honest with you? I do not give a crap about shoes. Like, fuck you, Tails. I, no, I I would be happy with ten dollars shoes. I'm not even kidding. Shoes give are shoes. Don't you lecture me with your three dollars shoes. Don't lecture <laughs> me with that. <clears throat> no, I actually have like sixty dollars shoes, but like, I'm not one of those people who collect like. Don't you lecture me with your sixty dollars shoes. <laughs> don't, don't you lecture me with your Home Depot fives. Don't you lecture me with your Toys R Us clothes. <laughs> they don't sell. They don't. They well, they sir. Uh, well, they 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 sold clothes at the the Toys R Us that was like near like in my city. Well, there's only one, but there's like a it, there there's like this big ass department department building that was the Toys R Us, but like they had like a small department right next to it, like a small little store next to it called Babies R Us. And they, oh yeah, and they sold baby yeah, clothes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, I got to head out, guys. I'll see you later. All right. Okay. Bye, Adam. All right. It was nice having him for the podcast. I don't know why, but everybody slowly started to like... If you made it this far in the video, everybody just sort of dipped. Right now, it's just only me, Moxie, and Hammer. I'm, 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 I'm not going to lie. What? This has not been a good one. Well, only because they ha there's been technical difficulties and stuff. But like, I, I would say it's been, it's been all right. I just feel like... Maybe it's just because we're coming off of, like, such a good shit cat. Yeah, I guess. But I, I feel like this one's been alright. I don't think it was... I, I don't think it was compared... Didn't watch it. Go watch it. I don't think it was compared to, like, the worst one we've made. Like, the, that worst one, I, I honestly think that was terrible, honestly. But this one, I don't think it's that bad. Oh, well... Which one was the worst one? Right? The one that literally is titled The Worst Episode Yet. Oh. You... The we're pretty honest. Yeah, it, it was the one with Badger in it. The one and only <laughs> the one and only one we had with Badger. Oh wow. But never I, again. No, but right now I feel like the vibe is like sort of like I guess like the first episode but just not as strong because you know, the first episode was just me Moxie and Sora and we were actually having a pretty fun time. And it's I feel like we just haven't laughed as much. I think that's why. Yeah. You know, you know, I'll just invite Ome Omega because Omega probably wants to be in the podcast as well. So Omega's I, here now. I have a question, Riff. Yes. Hi. Okay. I gotta I gotta go somewhere tomorrow. Okay. And, and I don't feel like getting back into my normal sleep schedule. Okay. So I just wanna ask, do you think instead of showering tonight, I should wake up earlier, shower, and then be ready? Yeah. Well, like, it just depends what you're going to do tomorrow. Uh, going to a driver's ed campus. Getting information there from 8 a.m. to 3 o'clock. Okay, so I, I would honestly say then just go to sleep earlier because if you're going to just wait to take a shower right now, uh, it just depends what time you're going to go to sleep tonight. I don't know. I, I, I'm, setting, <clears throat> I'm setting my bed off at like 1 a.m. 1 a.m. If I have to go to go to bed. bed. Oh. No, no, no. I mean, I went to sleep last night at like around two or two thirty. Because of that, I woke up late and I didn't get to go to church. So I have to wake up at eight o'clock for like eight thirty. It's annoying, but like, hey, I'll I'll do it. I can go any day. That's the good thing. My like, it's every. My sleep schedule has been like getting, I guess, progressively. I don't know, worse, I guess? Because I've been waking up every day, like, around, like, close to 10 to 11. Only because, like, I really don't have to go to a class in the morning. Like, there's no lectures. So, usually, if there's, like, a lecture in my college course or whatever, I will have to wake up, like, I... around 8 or 9. But, like, because I my don't have any lectures, schedule has just been terrible. I don't... I've been... I... I don't want to sleep. I, won't... I don't want to fix my sleep schedule. I just want to wake up earlier and not fall asleep. Yeah, I get that. Right. I, just... I like... 
I like staying up late, but I don't like waking up early. Or Cause, late. Because, like, school starts back first week of August. So then, after that, uh, I'm a junior. I get to party. Woot woot! I'm a little soft. And then, I'm gonna get my license in December. I'm gonna be like real and rev. Go out on the town. No, but I don't oh, yeah. drive. My friends do. <laughs> I forgot. I'm going to be like your friends, except n nothing like your friends. <laughs> that one detail, yeah. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be frankly honest. I do not trust a single one of my IRL friends driving me. That's understandable because you know you guys are still young. Yeah, you got some weird friends. My friends are all um, all my the same age as I am, so I trust them. Plus, I've known them I for would... like years. So. Oh well, Omega left. I was just about to ask him a question too. Fuck it. Omega. Oh Oh my god, oh my god. Funny thing is, I'm like the <coughs> second- the second youngest in my friend group. Hmm. I, I actually, would- I, Well, I actually am the- I was the second youngest, and then, uh, one of my friends just decided to leave the friend group recently, and I was just like, oh, okay, so I guess right now, technically, I am the youngest. So are you still the second youngest, or- Yeah, I'm the youngest yeah. now. The youngest left? Oh. All right. Uh, okay. I wanted to ask this question because Hammer, this is. I think you'll like this, Hammer. Okay. Would you rather give up cursing forever, or or give up ice cream for twelve years? Bro, this is such an easy question. Goodbye, ice cream. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. No, I'm giving up cursing forever. You would never curse ever again. Bro. Oh yeah, no. That I already say fudge and. Well, yeah, we I know that people people who don't know Hammer's been trying to not curse as much, and that's good. But like ice cream, bro. Listen, I am okay with giving up ice cream. I barely even. Eat. I need to. I need my fuck. <laughs> I need my fuck. <laughs> I need my. I need Me too, man. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, Gary's back after like half an hour, but it's okay. Shut up. <laughs> You sound so upset. I, we lost half of our team. Yeah, I had, to, I had to like, I had to like go up a flight, have three flights of stairs, and get groceries. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! up. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a troublemaker, Gary. Okay, this is this is this is okay. I don't even want to ask this question. Ask only me. No, DM it to me, and then I'll answer it. Okay. <laughs> Okay, oh, never mind. Okay, uh, 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 one runs, moing me. Shut up. Who turned, who left the vibrator on? What? Box, um, yeah, I sent it. <laughs> Family guy themed funeral, a hundred percent. <laughs> the question was would you rather have a south park themed wedding or a family guy themed funeral family guy themed <laughs> yeah i would want it you know that one thing where it's like and i already imagined my funeral right grandma got ran over by a reindeer <laughs> i want it to be like that <laughs> more on christmas eve <laughs> dude if i if i, I think been, like would you rather want to be in Dude, if I had a Family Guy funeral, I definitely want that the, the sad ass cutaway music. Like, da, 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 you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I mm -hmm. would want Peter and the Chicken to fight at my funeral. <laughs> they just like, they just like slam onto your coffin and just start yeah, beating each other. <laughs> they use me as a <laughs> <body>. <laughs> they, they fight with my body, and then everyone's, <laughs> and then and then everyone claps yeah. afterwards. Bro, frick. Yeah, they would they would use your limbs as well. <laughs> Bro, oh, shit. Here's a question. Here's a question. Would you rather mm -hmm. want to live in the world of South Park or the world of Family? I think it's an easy. Uh, honestly, I'd probably say Family Guy. Exactly. Because in South Park, they actually have like aliens and shit. And I'm just like that's and, weird. And it's a and, lot more gruesome in in South Park. Yeah, a and, lot. More and gruesome. like say like Satan is their best friend. Apparently, I'm just like okay. Oh heck no! What's up, Satan? Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Bro, I'm not gonna be friends with Satan. Screw that. Why? Satan's... No. Because Satan's. Because no one likes Satan. He's not and real. 
Yeah, he isn't, but like, and you wonder why he's so mean in media. You wonder why he's so mean. Because people are always mean to him. Okay, let's not def- no, let's not get defensive now. Listen, would you hug Satan? Because I would. No. no. He deserves a hug. What about you, no, Gary? Uh, get up. The one who's uh, an eternal pit of fire. Uh... He's not real. <laughs> it's just, it's he's, just, he's not. <laughs> it's just in like, in like in literature that I've learned recently. And there's a book called The Inferno or Dante's Inferno. But basically, Satan portray it, the way that they portray, portray Satan in that book is that Satan was like was like a a fallen angel that was actually like God's favorite angel. But then, the Satan wanted to just. Re- rebuke the lord and just be like oh he's full of shit basically and so because of that he, he got outcasted he got thrown into hell which is now why he reigns with, there now with all the other fallen angels yeah well good for him it's, I'm a, glad it's that a, no I'm, do not do not <laughs> i'm glad that was god, hell there i'm glad that god gave him a nice warm ho- home and like literally no. I'm glad. I'm glad that like, he's alive. He's got a no. job. He gets oh paid. God. Um. <laughs> oh my god. Got a job. Gets paid. Like all he has to do is take care of people who God doesn't like. That's not it's a funny. Happen. Sounds like a sitcom. <laughs> yeah, this is like a Family Guy cutaway right now. Okay, would you rather have a mullet or a perm? No, I hate mullets. I would take the perm. I hate mullet. A mullet. Uh, it's like the. I don't know how to explain it. It's like the hair. If you have a mullet. <laughs> yeah, 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 scary. It's the hair. It's the long hair that sticks I mean, out of. That's, like, that sticks at the back of your uh, neck. It's like. It's like what Blaziken has, kind of. Oh, <laughs> look at Muscle Man. That, look at Muscle Man. Muscle Man has a mullet, sort of. Or, no. Oh, I would get a mullet just to buzz cut it. Yes, I have. But you can't. Who cares? No, uh, no. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, I'm trying to. I, I'm trying. I, I'm trying to. Um. Uh, do you, have you ever seen a? Ba- uh, oh, uh, a hammer. You'll basically be like fucking Balthazar Brat from Despicable Me Three. That's you. a. That's a mullet. That's the worst Despicable Me villain. You really want to be like him? I'm no. a bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, why would you want to be that loser when you can be like Vector? No, be El Dr. Macho. No, be what? El Macho. El Macho is not the macho. best villain. Dr. El Nefaro. Macho is the best. Vi- Thank you, Rocky. No, no. What do you mean, no? El Macho was awesome. No, in, in the in the Gruniverse. That's no, what, what I like. I- that's what I like to call it. The despic- <laughs> uh, instead of the Despicable Me universe, it's the Gruniverse. Of all of these films, I would honestly say Scarlet Overkill's the best villain. What? I thought you hated women. Well, I, I thought so too. That's why you. That's why you told us in confidence a few days ago. I, yeah, Moxie, right. remember what I said yesterday? Whenever we were watching Rent a Girlfriend, I said that I'm a feminist. No, and I said no, you're not, and you're like, yeah, you're what? right. <laughs> I didn't. What, just hold me. It doesn't mean I'm a feminist. <laughs> Yeah, just because you're feminist doesn't mean you hate you can't hate women. I don't think that's okay. <laughs> it is. Are you saying are you saying that feminists can hate women? Uh I feel like it'd go against what they're <laughs> what they're trying to do. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, I'm just uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm just playing games on my computer while I'm chilling with my shift tree man most fun and he more plushy. This is the peak. Okay. Would you would you rather Yes. Would you ra- <laughs> Yes. Would you rather marry the most attractive person you'll ever meet or the best cook you've ever met? Bell. Cook. cook. Attractive. We could just door dash. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I don't care what the woman looks like. I just want I want I want I want the woman for me. The right woman. Save that. You yeah. saved that sentence. You, that sentence could have gone in so many ways. But you Re- remember, uh, remember, attractiveness is diversive, meaning like you think they're they're the most attractive person that you'll ever so meet. I'm, 
So I'm I'm gonna thank Bell. So I'm gonna marry Bell, and then we're gonna DoorDash Wendy's. Yeah, I'm gonna thank Bell, and then we. <laughs> oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh okay. Um, Gary, that's it, Gary. That's it. We're having what? a duel. Well, I was making a bell sound. A ding. A no, eight bell. Eight, ding. No, here's your pistol. Eight paces south. And then we shoot. Oh. Or he'd be like, he's gonna be like Tom from Tom and Jerry, and just turn around and shoot <laughs> that one video that I sent. Never. All ready? right, Gary, you ready? Eight paces. Right. One, two. No. Got him. <laughs> you had that ready, didn't you? That's why you said it in yes. the first place. Yeah. Who spilled guts on my carpet? Oh man, why is there a carpet outside? Oh man. Okay. Would you rather have a third ear or a third eye? A third ear? Uh, no. I'd rather have a third degree burn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, a hammer over here would rather have a third nipple. Uh. I mean, a third nipple is a third nipple. Uh. I. Where you said eye or ear? Yeah. Where would the third ear even go? Uh, where would it go, actually? <laughs> I can imagine a third eye going, like, right above Imagine it's, like, a, 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 since both are on your left and your right, imagine it's, like, in the back of your neck. <laughs> no, 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 even worse. Oh. What, if it's un what, what, is, what if it's under your chin, front of your neck? Ew, gross. What if it's just, like, Crocker and you get one on your neck? <laughs> There's my pants! Here we go, pants! That would make a perfect cosplay. <laughs> you have three. You have to hunch over <laughs> like him too. Yeah. Not being able to hit the quad. Tinny. 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 Uh, I I guess third eye. Mm, nice. I probably say third eye as well. I mean, if because you want a croc. Because if. Because if, like, someone pisses you off, you'd be like, yo, I'm about to call Psychic on your ass, and then you just pull out your third eye. <laughs> like, you hide it under it's your... Like, yo, yeah, and like, then they're like, oh! Yeah, just get bangs. Just get really long bangs, and then boom, you can hide it. You would have to wear, like, a hoodie to hide your third ear. Which hoodies are... With hoodies the third are... eye, you could just be like, someone makes fun of you. Oh, you testing my little knowledge, boy. Oh. Oh. You would... You, when everyone, when anyone's like, all right, guess how many fingers I'm holding up, you would always win. Exactly. Oh, you got any? Do, is there any benefits from the third eye or, or third ear, or is it just I don't, literally I don't know. Anymore? Better sight, I'm guessing. Better hearing. I don't fucking know. You can never Damn, sleep. Man. You can never sleep well because always one ear will be oh. out, or one eye would be open. No, 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 no. You can close all three eyes. One ear would always be outside of the covers, all cold. How would you close your third? You're eye saying that you sleep with the blanket over your ears. I sometimes do. I don't like my ears. He's getting cold. With your ears, he's getting cold. My ears, he's getting cold. I don't want my you. I don't I want my ears. He's getting cold. Wevy. <laughs> Great. Stop. Don't call me that. Don't. You, you can say Revy. I don't mind Revy, but don't say Wevy ever again. Okay. Levy sounds like something an anime waifu would call him. Yay! That's probably what he wants. Yay! No, I don't. Yeah. Okay. What would you want your perfect woman to call you? Would you rather throw the best? <laughs> yep. <laughs> would you rather throw the best parties ever, but you have to clean up, but you have to clean up the mess all by yourself, or oh, no. or go to a go to parties what? every single night for the rest of your life. Oh, I would go with I would go to a party every night. You know how cool I would be? I'd be like But for the me. rest of your life, like every single day, y even as you get older. Okay, it doesn't say how long you have to stay. Oh. Just show Ooh. up. Just but show up. Take one drink, leave. <laughs> leave. Yeah, definitely. You're gonna drink that drink and then you're gonna drive home. No. Yes. It, no one said it was an alcoholic drink. We could be going to like we be, we could be going to like just go to someone's fridge and child. like just pick up a water. We just go to like someone's like D and D night. That's technically a party. Dungeons and Dragons. You fucking weirdo. <laughs> Dragons is yeah. awesome. You fucking weirdo. I'm not weird. Dungeons and Dragons is fun. Gary, your turn. Uh, I guess. Uh, 
All right. right. No, you're, uh, you're, supposed to, you're supposed to say you. Oh, uh, you loser. <laughs> okay, anyways, um, I guess I would go to... Uh, okay. Is it like the same? It's like different parties every day, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. And you and it so doesn't like, say you have to stay for the entire party. Because, okay, I guess if thinking of thinking about it, you could like, you could be like known as a legend for going to like everyone's party. So like, people would want you to go to their parties, and like you would have time to go to everyone's party like a day. And who says you can't go to multiple parties a day? So like. You could just spend all day going to parties. Like, that would seem fun. And you would yes. get a lot of free shit out of it. Free food, free drinks. Like, hell, maybe maybe even, like, one of the parties would be a sleepover. Free uh, free place to sleep. So if you're homeless, it'd be perfect. Yeah. If you're homeless, just go okay. to a party. Okay, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to pick the first option where you have to, where it's the best party. Because, like, it's only going to be, like, I'm, only, I'm, I would, I'm not all for parties. Like, I don't like throwing parties i don't like Me having neither. a party oh i kind of just like quietness sometimes. listen hammer you have to throw a party and when you do it's going to be the great gats level of party you want to clean that up by yourself yes you poor soul i mean you can make it like uh i don't know i'll uh, just get one of those roombas or something i mean if it was was a Dungeons and Dragons party, not much to clean up. Oh yeah, that's up. true. Depending on what party you have, there's not too oh, much. Oh yeah, you're a loser. Up. That's right. I forgot. <laughs> the best party ever just depends on what person it is. So it yep. could be a, it could be a small party, and you're probably just going to be cleaning up like. Chip you bowls. know what? Keep telling yourself that size does not matter. What? That's what women tell me every time. Exactly. Why, anyway, why, why? Rev, next what question. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Would you rather? Yes. <laughs> Shut up, man. I'm sorry. Would you rather? We... What? It's okay, buddy. It's. Okay. I, was... I didn't mean to interrupt. Are Are we what, sorry. Hammer? Are we what? Are we there yet? No. Can we ban him? Can we actually ban him? I'm being serious. Can we ban him? No. Slash SRS. <laughs> Slash serious. All right. Would you rather never? Hold on. <laughs> Uh, uh oh, you do you want to DM this one to me? Oh no 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 no! I'm just trying to find out a good one. <laughs> Damn it! I was gonna ask this one, but I already know Gary's answer. <laughs> Say it. <laughs> would, yeah. would you rather I... eat chocolate on pizza? You die. <laughs> die. Or or never eat chocolate ever again? Gee! <laughs> I chocolate. Um, never eat chocolate again. If only oh, Kiko were here, she would be defending me. <laughs> All right. Kiko, Kiko could have came to this. She just didn't. No, she she could she, she couldn't. She couldn't. All right. She could. She couldn't. <laughs> she could. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that you made that. Oh my god! Do you think someday we could get BTD on the shit cast? Dude, I would, I would love that. I would love to have BTD on the podcast. Honestly, amazing. Maybe. I would That'd honestly, fun, I would yeah. honestly want BTD like just, well, just to react to a, a shit cast episode, dude. I, like he doesn't even have to like post it or whatever. He just oh you could just send it to me personally. Oh just God. him listening or reacting to it. Just, that would know. be fun. All right, so this is gonna be the last oh. question because we're a little bit over an hour and a half. No, she called me one. Right. <laughs> yeah. Would you rather? <laughs> would you rather lose all of your teeth or all of your hair? Oh, hair, definitely. Oh, uh, get a wig. Actually, wait a minute. Can you get dentures? I don't know. If you can get dentures, then I would choose There's dentures because no once you get dentures. Never have to brush your teeth again. Think about that. I lose all my hair. <laughs> you're making it all. You're making it complicated, Moxie. I always make things complicated. That's what I'm Here, best at. Here's the you can thing. ask Gary. You can ask Gary. Here's the thing. I don't give a crap if I'm bald, cause like exactly. I don't. I don't like my hair. 
I've honestly been like consider I eat like I've been thinking about this for like like the past couple of years, but I'm just like one day like in the summer because I won't I won't like be able to like go anywhere or do anything because I usually don't do that much stuff in the summer, but like before the summer or even before that I I wanted to just like shave my entire head just so I can just so like see how my hair grows or whatever see if my hair grows a different way. I don't fucking know. Would you allow us to make fun of you for I mean I'm pretty sure all my IRL friends are going to do that. So, like, I don't really care. I, w- I also want to, like, I just want to pull off different looks with, with it. Like, I can use, I mean, I can use like, a head, like a headband or, like, a, a get- hat, you know. Okay, well, can I call you a nickname if you do do I mean, we already gave Gary a nickname whenever he was quote-unquote bald. No, no, I'm talking about when you're... I want to call you Mr. Limpo. No. Mr. Limpo. He doesn't understand. You're right. No, I just don't care. No, not you. (laughs) Not you, Red. You you obviously understand. I just... No, I don't understand. I just don't care. Oh, it's Mr. Clean. Oh. Oh, you said Mr. Clean. You know what you should care about, though? Yeah. Subs- the end of this podcast. The end of this podcast. Yeah, yeah. Uh, please, yes. I was kind of <sighs> stop. I was gonna say. So I was gonna just say you should care about subscribing to Gary. Oh, I love you. Yay! Gary. Hooray! You're my. Hooray. You're one of my greatest friends, Gary. Let's do our secret oh, handshake. Shit. <laughs> okay, I'm fucking the cop song. Beep, beep, boom, 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 boom. Yeah. <laughs> we, we we add the cartoon uh, uh, squiggle effect where it's like. Yeah. 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 And then and then we hit it with a fist pound. Boom. Oh, and you guys yeah. should and pound that like button cool. and subscribe for more shitcast episodes. Thank you guys for watching the shitcast. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye guys, I'm ending it. Bye. <laughs> uh, I, I hope uh, I hope they know that I can still we talk. Rev. Wait, they can still hear Rev. Exactly, Shit, you no, fucking no, idiot. No. Exactly, oh, you no. fucking idiot. No. no. You think I'm the one recording the damn thing? Listen, I. You are the one recording. I don't know how OBS works.